Well, what does it take to be on a reality show? Apparently, it's harder than it looks. Yeah, a contestant on a reality show based off of Netflix's popular series Squid Game is sharing his experience. In Squid Game, The Challenge, more than 400 contestants play children's games for a chance to win a whopping $4.5 million. Dr. Kian Vu played as number 330, or 330, I should say. He spoke with New Six producer Brooke Savage and says moments that appeared to be five to ten minutes actually took up to eight hours to oh. record, like when they played red light, green light. People thought you were going to pause for only 30 seconds up to a minute or something like that, but no, people actually had to hold their positions for up to 15 to 45 minutes at a time. So if you were in a position that was really hard to hold, you were probably going to give up. This is why up to 279 players got eliminated after that first challenge. That sounds terrible. What were they doing, a cartwheel in the middle of... I don't know, but you know, the way they get eliminated is that they are wearing these packs, like if you rob a bank, and I never have, and the dye, the ink thing goes off, you're wearing one of these packs on your chest, and it blows up, and it's like black ink. So you're out. Oh, okay. So imagine 200-something of those going on. So you otherwise. don't actually get killed in the squid game, is what you're saying. <laughs> Gee, I hope not, That's because good. I, would hope I not. wouldn't think yeah. we would be doing that. <laughs> he says there was a lot of distractions, too. Drones flew in to check on people moving. So Brooke will post the full interview on his experience and why he says it really shows how people make decisions under stress. You can find it on clickorlando.com. So interesting. She'll also be sharing an interview in her newsletter exploring the theater and art scene in Central Florida. It goes out this Friday. Just go to clickorlando.com newsletter to subscribe and setting the stage.